high gas prices encouraging more and more people to go electric and under a Biden administration plan, our states had to receive nearly $38 million to expand our alternative fuel corridor. Kirsten Joy is now connecting with one expert to discuss the current trends in EV charging. We are now seeing some of the big players wake up. In addition to leader Tesla, major automakers like GM and Volvo are making huge investments in the production of EVs. How great to see Ford with the F-150 Lightning, the Mustang mach -E. I don't think they can build enough. But this momentum is at risk of stalling, Roger Atkin says, if the charging process does not become as easy as possible. He is the founder of Electric Vehicles Outlook in the UK, also an advisor to Momentum Dynamics. He just completed a North American tour sharing more about wireless charging technology that is currently being used in Oslo and Sweden. This whole principle of what they call grazing rather than guzzling just makes more sense. Imagine driving an electric vehicle over a wireless charging pad without having to lift a finger or get out of the vehicle. Momentum Dynamics would like to make this a reality for all. The company is a leader in wireless charging technology. It's found that the solution to range anxiety isn't putting bigger batteries into cars that can hold more charge. It's letting the charging infrastructure itself contribute to extending the driving range of vehicles. The battery is the biggest, well, certainly a big chunk of the cost of an EV, if we can see this happen with cars, if we can have smaller batteries which cost less, we can bring the price of EVs down, you know, probably quicker than we would have done and deliver wireless charging, you know, a little and often rather than having to fill the whole thing up for hours. Kirsten Joyce, live local now.